guys, welcome! My name is Deanna and I am a Lego Harry Potter fanatic. Today we are reviewing Hogwarts Moment Charms class. I'm a Ravenclaw, we had to start with charms, get excited. This set is 256 pieces, they're only $30. And it took me like 25 minutes to build. Professor Flitwick is the head of Ravenclaw. Professor Flitwick is awesome. In the Harry Potter movie franchise, he does get a makeover, but this character is definitely the original form of Flitwick that we see in the movies and maybe a little bit closer to his book form as well. Fun fact, Professor Flitwick is actually a dueling champion. He is a No, but really, he's really cool. Uh, he does so much for Harry, Ron, and Hermione. He's just a good teacher. He's encouraging. He's also very chill. He's one of the few teachers that isn't taking away house points all the time. He doesn't give detentions. Maybe because he teaches charms, and charms is one of the core Hogwarts classes, so you have to take it in your first five years. If you owl out, you owl out, but you do have to take it in your first five years. And when you think of charms, that is what muggles think of as magic. This is the traditional sense of what you think magic is, an incantation, pronunciation, a flourish of the wand, and something magical happens. I wasn't excited about these moment sets by Lego, and I really like this build. I was so pleasantly surprised. Let's start with who's included. It is the small figure of Harry, so we don't know what year it is. We also get a small figure of Chow, which is interesting because she's not actually introduced until later in the book, so she's not in book one or two, or movie one or two, sorry but she is one of the more famous Ravenclaws in the series. By famous, I just mean the ones that we know. Comment down below and let me know who is, of course, the most famous Ravenclaw. Comment down below. Don't get it wrong. Don't get it wrong. Also, can you guess who my favorite character is in the entire Harry Potter series? Comment down below and let me know. It's a girl. She's amazing. She might be a part of the Silver Trio. If you're a real Potterhead, you'll know what the Silver Trio is. If not, keep watching my videos and you'll get to know all this good Harry Potter tea. Charms is located in the third floor corridor of Hogwarts Castle. This is a really cute representation. I'm not going to pick it up because the biggest flaw with this set is it's not very sturdy. It's a gorgeous set. I like what was included. In fact, we even get the feathers from the very first scene of charms that we ever see in the Harry Potter franchise when Guardian Leviosa and Seamus blow something up. But those are actually included in this cute little trunk here. What makes this so amazing is how well it folds up into a book. Oh, I told you it's very frail. Okay, I got it back together. But look at how cute and how clean. And originally, I thought this was bigger. And I love how small it is. I think it's so beautiful. And my experience with Lego has been that Lego likes stickers. So it's really lovely to see a printed piece. And... Most importantly, most importantly, the sigil, that's an eagle. It's not a raven. There's so much trademarked merchandise from the Wizarding World of Harry Potter, or the Wizarding World, or whatever it is, that has a raven. Ravenclaw is a name. Like, Gryffindor is a name. The animal is an eagle, which is just really awesome that we have that on a printed piece. It's just so right. It's so right. Cute little charms. Again, we were talking about Wingardium Levioso, so that flying feather there. Um, the back's just got like a cute little nothing. And then we can open it up. And each of these pieces open. 
and this is just a good basic representation of the charms classroom we haven't gotten a charms classroom in any of the big harry potter sets yet that i'm aware of feel free to comment down below if i'm wrong and let me know because i would like to get that very much please but if not i'm pretty sure it hasn't been in any of the sets yet honestly we get a lot of potions maybe because it's the easiest thing to display you know creating little potions for lego it's not the easiest thing to display a charms classroom you know but i really like this and i'm excited to build the other three in this set because of course it is one for each of the hogwarts houses this is charms which is ravenclaw and professor flitwick is the head of ravenclaw he's rumored to be part elf we don't actually know what he is the students aren't rude enough to ask because again, he is a really cool teacher. Like people just really like him. He takes care of his students really well. He is fierce. He is so fierce for someone who's so nice. The Caros, oh! When the Caros take over Hogwarts, Flitwick absolutely fights against them. Flitwick is also who says that Dumbledore should be laid to rest on the Hogwarts grounds. I wish we could have seen more of him in the movies. We do get a good description of him in the books, but really I'd like to know just more about his backstory. He did go to school with Dumbledore, so like Dumbledore was like really good at Transfiguration. Obviously Flitwick was like dope at Charms, so it would have been interesting to see what they got themselves into. You can see detailed photos of this build on my Instagram at LegoHPFanatic. Please make sure you like this video if you haven't already, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and if you'd like to see more videos like this, click right here. Thanks so much. Bye.